In a bid to reduce the impact of forced subsidy removal, President Bola Metinubu of Nigeria has written to the House of Representatives seeking approval to provide 500 billion Nigerian currency to fund palliative measures for the citizens. The Nigerian leader wants the lower legislative chamber to amend the 2022 Supplementary Appropriation Act to accommodate the provision. The request was contained in a letter President Tinubu wrote to the House of Reps and which the Speaker, Tajuddin Abbas, read during the plenary on Wednesday. The President said he hoped the lawmakers would consider his request expeditiously. He, however, assured the citizens that the framework for palliatives to remedy the effect of forced subsidy removal is being worked out, explaining that the decision to phase out the subsidy was taken in the best interest of the country. He said the decision would guarantee future prosperity. The president had announced the forced subsidy removal during his inauguration address on May 29, 2023, in response to claims that the subsidy regime favored the rich more than the average Nigerians, among other reasons. Meanwhile, the Nigerian Labour Congress and the Trade Union Congress have played down the 500 billion palliative proposed by the president. The labour unions say they are demanding a 300% increment in salary to enable workers to cope with the challenges caused by the deteriorating economic situation in the West African country. Kamil Sadiq, CBA TV, Nigeria.